Hello, this is Max Williams with Robinson in Harris Real Estate, and today we're in Chesterfield County. More specifically, we are in the Bon Air section of Chesterfield, and we're going to take a look at this three-bedroom, two-full-bath home situated here in a nice, established neighborhood. Uh, this home was built in 1963, and uh, it's actually been on the market for a little while, and needs a little bit of TLC, nothing major. And the beautiful thing about a home that needs a little bit of TLC is that a huge segment of the population uh, of the buying market is not interested. They want a home that they can just simply close and move. And uh, if you have the inclination to either take on some of this work yourself or have someone else do it, then this may be a great route for you. Uh, as we come into the home, we have a few choices. We can either go straight ahead, uh, that leads into the kitchen and to the right to the bedrooms, or here to the left. We've got a nice open floor plan. The sunken living room was something that was very, very popular in years gone by, and this home does have it. The wood floors would look very, very nice if they were just simply refinished. We've got plenty of light that flows in through that front window. We do have a co-closet convenient here to the front door. We're going to step on through and we're actually going to go to the kitchen first. Now, I saw pictures uh, for when this home was previously listed a few years ago and uh, it looked really nice. Um, unfortunately, since the appliances have been taken out, the uh, microwave or range hood is gone. Uh, the refrigerator used to be right there uh, and this flooring does need to be replaced. Uh, once those things were done, I think this would definitely be a, a very serviceable kitchen, serviceable kitchen. Uh, these doors can actually be uh, either left the way they are or simply painted. We do have a high definition laminate countertop. It looks like granite, but it's not. And a double bowl sink there, dishwasher uh, is in place. Here to the left, we've got a nice size pantry. This is great for additional food storage. And in the dining area, we have a gas log fireplace Nice brick wall all the way across. By the way, this home is 100% brick all the way around. So we've got a nice large corner lot here, as you can see. It's very cold outside, so we're not gonna go back out there. You just have to take my word for it. It's a nice sloping lot on the corner. Pretty rare in Richmond to see a finished basement. This home does have it. As a result of having the sloped lot, they were able to take advantage of that and have a walkout basement. So we've got nice, nice floor plan in that regard. We do have a wood burning fireplace there. Straight ahead, that door is a utility room. This home does heat with oil and there is central air. If somebody wanted to switch out and either put in a heat pump or some alternative type of heating, that would also be a possibility. Gas is so cheap now, oil doesn't look that bad as a heating fuel. Okay, we come to the second part of the Downstairs basement. I guess the basement's always downstairs, but you know what I mean. A little bit of storage there, and then this goes back into the utility room. There are two side entrances on this house, so you can come in from the parking area on two different doors. We're gonna go back upstairs, take a look at the bedroom area. I love to come to these homes, give you an idea of what's available in the marketplace. Uh, I hand pick these homes. I do not represent the seller on them. I represent buyers looking for great deals. I handpicked this home for a few reasons. Number one, monthly payments under a thousand dollars a month. Very, very tough to do with this square footage in this area. We have a coat closet there. Lenders are also getting very flexible compared to the last few years as far as lending standards. So that's gonna be a big, big plus for potential buyers. Just some simple updates here in the bathroom. We've got a tile bathroom, a little bit larger than average. Linen closet there. Bedroom number two. These wood floors will look really nice just with a simple refinishing. And now on to our master, which is right here. 
good natural light flows in. There's actually a double size closet there. And our three quarter bath for the master is right here. Just some simple cleaning up of that tile work. Uh, we go a long ways. This was a, a handy person project went wrong there. That was not the proper application there for the uh, vanity top, but I guess it worked for them. If you have any questions about this or any other home, please feel free to give me a call. Please like my page on Facebook. It's Richmond Area Foreclosures. If you have any questions whatsoever, give me a call. My name is Max Williams. I can reach you at 402-7788. The price in this home is a hundred, about 150,000. But uh, I have a feeling I could get it for you for substantially less. If you have any questions, 402-7788. Thanks so much for taking the tour. Have a great day.